Wow. Now, ladies, let me know if you are open to this type of relationship. Let's paint a scenario. Let's say that the guy makes a lot of money and you decide to do it just for the money. Would you still do it? Let me know. The current sleeping arrangements at home is that we all share one bed. Morning. <laughs> just getting up here. Part of that is because of space. I mean, we have the <laughs> smallest house ever right now. We we had to work it out the way we worked out and it ended up working out in a way that we prefer. Not, not one of us spends a night without Nick because it's very special um, to be able to, you know, sleep next to the one you love for sure. I like to be snuggled up in the middle. Wow. <laughs> a nice spot for me. <laughs> so it's okay. I'll get the buns out here in like a minute. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Coming up. I love it. Mm -hmm. Our really? schedule for sex is um, whenever I feel like it or whenever they feel like it. <laughs> no, we... Our schedule for sex is that there is no schedule for sex. Try to make sure everybody's taken care of. <laughs> you... We need to give this guy a medal. <laughs> we always wow. make sure that we're in a separate area of the house when Nick's doing his thing, um, having one-on-one. -on -one. I want to know what he did. What he said to them. I wonder if I could do the same thing. That's crazy. I've never had to explain our relationship to William because it's always been something that's just been normal for him. Mm -hmm. And he's grown up with friends that are raised by their grandparents or raised by their aunts and uncles. He's been exposed. I do not see a black woman doing this though. You can imagine that. You can imagine a black man staying home and have two black wives. Now, if he do that, he deserves to be on the higher food chain, like future. He deserves to be up there. I could see, I could see future doing that, you know. But kudos to this man. He's really holding it down for the black community. <laughs> kudos to him.